Guys, I'm going to share with you on this video the quickest way to quit your nine to five job so that you can do rank and rent full time. Now, for those that are new to this channel, to this model we call rank and rent, very simply put, it is this incredible business model where we are basically doing real estate investing, but we're doing it on the internet. We're building tiny websites like tiny homes, like duplexes or single family homes. We are finding tenants for these properties, in this case, business owners, and we are charging them rent. They're paying us rent, and then we just subtract our overhead from the rent, and we collect the rest as passive income. We are a middleman, but we own the assets. We control the assets. It is the business model that has allowed me to move my family to West Africa, as well as have a house in the U.S. It has allowed me to get out of debt. It has allowed me to, to, do, real, to do, I think I have four properties in real estate right now, it has allowed me to invest in, in uh, multiple companies at this point, to, to be involved in syndicates. It is the most impressive business model on the internet because it checks all the boxes that need to be checked with a quote unquote side hustle. But I want to talk real and I want to talk uh, about something that I see happen very often. It's something that I went through. Maybe you're on this channel. Maybe you are watching this going, man, I would love to be able to be my own boss and, and just I love doing this stuff. It sounds so fascinating, but I need to get out of my nine to five because it's consuming all of my hours, all my energy. So what's the quickest path? How do we do it? Now, here's what I'm going to recommend. This may shock some of you guys because I'm always, always, always talking about, uh, uh, you know, uh, rank and rent, rank and rent, rank and rent, or rent, then rank, rent, then rank, rent, then rank. But in some cases, if you are a nine to fiver that needs to quit your job quickly, I'm going to tell you what I did to be able to make enough money to pay the bills. And in my case, I was already, I had already quit my job, but at, at, in 2017, my wife was threatening that if we didn't start making money, then I was going to have to get a job. And this was coming off of the ass end of a failed startup. And this puts us July 28th of 2017 when I realized that the software company I thought I was building, that the, the code that I thought was being written was not being written, that I was getting scammed, that I was not getting any code and that it was time to start taking care of my family. And so I said to my wife, she said, you need to go get a job. You need to start taking care of this family. And that stung. And she said, go talk to this person. Go talk to this person. I said, I'm not getting a job. She said, well, then you need to go back to sales because that you got to take care of us. I was like, that's fair. So I said, give me three days to go and make some money. Three days to go to make some money. How much do we need to pay the bills, the house payment, the cars, et cetera? We had $3,000 in our bank account at the time. Our monthly nut with cars, bills, everything else was about 6K. I said, I will have six, I will have $3,000 cash um, in the bank account within three days. Give me three days. And that's all I asked. She said, okay, you have three days, knowing there's no way I could do it. But I knew that a couple of years previous to that, or 18 months previous to that, I had started learning how to do SEO. I had started learning, I had started learning how to build websites. I had started learning how to move websites in the, the Google search rankings to the top of page one for certain search terms. And so guess what I did? I pounded the phones. I started getting on the phone. I started calling my buddies. I started calling the people I knew. I started calling my business owner buddies, the people that were trying to make money. I said, I can get you, I can get a website ranked for you. I can get a website ranked. I can get a website ranked. And I was able to generate in three days, $3,000. Boom, boom, boom. It had taken me a year of not making money, trying to chase a software business that was not going to work. That um, quite frankly was a mistake. In the beginning, I should have just done rank and rent, but I was too good for it. But I was able to generate $3,000 just like that. I told my wife then, I said, give me another month. The next month, I was able to close $10,000. I was able to collect $10,000 in cash. And that was what, what allowed me to literally survive. Because if it wasn't for that, I would have had to get a job. And I wouldn't have gotten a 9 to 5. I would have gotten a sales job. But I would have been backpedaling into the exact place that I came out of. And so... I want to let you guys know that for some of you that are desperate to get out of your jobs, that you need to get out, that it's, it's, it's toxic or you don't see your family or it's sucking your soul, I would argue that the quickest way to do it would be to simply go and get a few SEO jobs to pay the bills 
And as soon as you're able to pay your bills, you immediately transition into full-time rank and rent. And I hesitate to even say this. I hesitate to even make this video because I don't want people to get distracted because here's what happened to me is I made that money. And then I started thinking, well, man, that's quick money. That's a quick 10 grand. And the next month I went and did it again. And then again, and before you knew it, two years had passed and I was sitting holding an eight to $10,000 per month SEO business, which some of you guys say sounds great. But instead of one boss, as most of you guys have, I had eight to 10 bosses. And the problem with SEO as a long-term play is you don't own anything. You don't control anything. The business owner tells you when to jump, how high to jump and what the website needs to look like and when you need to change the pictures. They call you when they want to cancel. They call you when you do a good job. They call you when you do want to do a bad job or when you do a bad job, you have no control. And so the long-term play is always building assets. But I want to make this video because there are some of you that will watch this. There are some of you that are like, I got to get out of this. And if it were me and I was sitting in a nine to five right now and I was trying to just quit it as soon as possible so I could get into this digital world and at least give myself location freedom, I would go and sell SEO. I would go and nail a couple SEO deals. I'd go get four or five to 10,000 to 1500 to $2,000 SEO clients, ramp myself from about 10 to $15,000 per month. It has a high margin. I'm probably going to be making 12 to $13,000 profit if I'm doing all of it myself without outsourcing any of it or out, out having a team. And then I'm going to do what I would do at that point is I would batch it and I would cover, I would take care of all of my clients Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday if needed, if I still needed Wednesday. And Thursday, Friday, I would go all in on rank and rent. Actually, I would do that backwards from what I just said. I would go all in on rank and rent the first two, two and a half, three days of the week. And I would save the scraps for the SEO. I would always want to put the, the breadwinner, the thing that I want to do long-term, that would always get the priority. Okay. What I was trying to say, what I'm trying to say is how I would share the days. I would try and do the bare minimum that I could in order to retain the client, right? Because I know they're going to cancel anyway but it's giving me enough of a runway in order to build properties, in order to quit my job and spend those extra two days that I would not have, or those extra three days I would not have at a nine to five and spend them building my rank and rent digital real estate business. This is exactly how I would do it. If I'm sitting here watching this video right now and you hate your job and you wanna get out of it, but you know that it might take a minute to get the rank and rent going because you don't have time because you, 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 your job requires you nine to five in person. This is, this is a viable option. It's something that I did do. And the, again, the problem that I did is I went down the path and I spent two years chasing SEO money and ended up in 2019 frustrated, barely scraping by and ready to walk away from on, honestly all digital, um, uh, marketing. I was so frustrated because I was getting those calls at Disneyland at SeaWorld. Hey, Nick, uh, appreciate your help, but we're going to have to cancel because of X, Y, and Z. Hey, Nick, you did a great job, but we're going to have to go ahead and cancel because of this. Okay. I got so tired. I was like, I will never trade another, another second of my time for dollars again. And since that time, that is exactly what I've done. And we have gone from barely scraping by, barely paying the bills to making millions of dollars because assets work while you're sleeping. They work while you're, while you're eating. They work while you're golfing. They work while you're traveling. That's how you scale. But for those of you that are trying to get out of your nine to five as soon as possible to be able to do this full time, I believe SEO is the quickest way to be able to get out, get a couple bucks coming in, get three, four, five, ten thousand $10,000 coming in, boom and then get all of your attention to rank. And as a bonus, be smart about it. Get your SEO clients in industries where you know you can go and do a lead generation site. So I'm going to go sell a concrete site. I'm going to go sell SEO concrete website or SEO concrete deal in, uh, uh, let's use an example. Let's say um, Fayetteville, North Carolina. And I've already done the homework and I already know if I get the SEO deal, I can turn around and take some of the profits and buy, <coughs> excuse me, build a rank and rent website that I own that I can also sell to that same business owner and transition from time trading my time for dollars to owning assets and, and controlling assets and building an empire.
This is how you get out of the nine to five as soon as possible so that you can do rank and rent digital real estate full time.